Fed report secret repo loans to mega banks in 2020 eclipsed 2008 bailouts. Delta dump shows 48 trillion in stealth funding. So Fun, that, what's that? No, that that's where all the inflation went. That's uh, that's what blows my mind when you hear about all this money printed and you just 48 trillion dollars. That's insane. Yeah, all going to <laughs> banks like that's that's not actually. On the controversial bank bailouts and troubled asset relief program in 2008, reports show in late 2019 and 2020, the U.S. Federal Reserve participated in providing trillions of dollars in secret repo loans to mega banks. While Wall Street eagerly awaits the Federal Reserve's next benchmark rate hike decision, a number of investigative reports show the U.S. Central Bank participated in massive bank bailouts that are of biblical proportions. First report stems from Wall Street on parades Pam and Russ Martins, which accused the Fed of secretly loaning the French megabank BNP Paribas $3.84 trillion in the first quarter of 2020. The Martin's findings highlight many more secret loans that come from a data dump derived from the New York Federal Reserve Branch. The data dump showcases secret repo loans from the Fed to megabanks from September 2019 to July 2020. First quarter, by the way, 2020. Yeah. So before anything actually mm, started weird, huh? happening, they were getting trillions of dollars to these banks, which everybody that was watching the financial markets at the time knew they were having a major liquidity crisis. If we don't get lots of money to these banks really fast, we're going to have major problems. And then all of a sudden, and look at this. Here we go. Look at that. That's insane. What a scam. It is a scam. I trust this Federal Reserve. I trust it. I trust it, guys. Yeah. Uh, Mainstream media has uh, here, uh, heretofore instituted a news blackout on the names of the banks that receive the repo loan bailouts. Wow. You, you wonder who runs the mainstream media, folks? Uh, you, you guys may be uh, interested to know this. Did you know, guys know that uh, their uh, big pharma, you know, Pfizer and all, all of these companies, you guys do know that they have a board seat on every single mainstream media company that there is. Of course. Think about it. The banks do too, I'm sure. But I don't, you, I don't, I don't have that exactly to, to say it's, it is true. When you pay the bills, you get to say who sits on the board. Absolutely. And you get to, and you say, get to say who you can and cannot say on TV. Yep. There, there are two names. There are two names that I know for sure the mainstream media is not allowed to say. And when you say these names on YouTube, you get your channel taken down. That's a true fact. Uh, we've seen it. There are other YouTubers that I know in crypto that have verified that this is true, that they just mentioned one of these two names on their show, and they immediately got taken down. You don't think this media blackout stuff exists? It does. That's why you don't need to be getting your, me your news from the mainstream media. It just uh, said that's I can't believe they come right out and say it. Mainstream media news has blacked out the banks. Well, that's the expose. The, there was an expose that released all this and they discovered the blackout. 